Well, hey everyone, I wanna spend the next few minutes just talking about the philosophy of worship and the very first principle of why we worship. And it's so important to have a why. Often in music, we start with what we need to practice. For the heart of worship, you wanna start with why we do it. Number one, worship is for God. God has made us as worshipers. We all are born inherently with a desire to worship something. God has made us to worship him. In fact, the psalmist wrote multiple times about the, the, the way we were wired. Um, in Psalm 139, David writes about that God has put us, knit us together in our mother's womb. I mean, from the very beginning, he's made us for something uh, greater than we could, far, uh, we could understand outside of him. And so worship, as you look through the scriptures, there's this painting of a picture of, of worship being specifically for God. You see it through the Old Testament scriptures. You see it through the life of David in particular. One Psalm that I love that really points this out is Psalm 96. And it starts with, oh, sing to the Lord a new song. Sing to the Lord all the earth. Sing to the Lord, bless his name. Tell of his salvation from day to day. You skip forward a few verses. For great is the Lord and greatly to be praised. One of the most often repeated phrases in the Old Testament scriptures. And G Jesus himself would have prayed these prayers. He would have sang these psalms. A few verses later, verse 7 in chapter 96, ascribe to the Lord of families of the peoples. Ascribe to the Lord glory and street. Ascribe to the Lord the glory due his name. Bring an offering and come into his courts. Worship the Lord in the splendor of holiness. Tremble before him all the earth. At the end of the day, the very foundation for why we worship is that worship is for God. He's created us to worship him. We all can spend our lives pursuing so many different things that are lesser than him. But why we worship is simply worship is for God. And when we meet together, God joins us. Heaven meets earth. It's an incredible thing that happens, uh, that transcendent experience. So every experience, the philosophy of why we do what we do, we hope that people have left knowing that they've met with God, knowing that they're built to, to worship him first, and that worship ultimately begins with him in that relationship. That is why we worship. Worship is for God, principle one.